Hello friends. At Annamalai Adimai, we have embarked on a mission uh, to feed our young generation of today uh, with the elixir of divine grace. In this video, we want to examine how Siddhar Idaikadar had predicted that there would be outbreaks of pandemics and epidemics in the Tamil year which bears the name Sarvari. Idaikadar Siddhar is a Siddha who belongs to the 18 Siddha lineage at the apex of which is the Mahaguru Sri Agastya Maharishi. He is a disciple of Boganadar. Bogar, all of us know, had created uh, the Navabhashana Vigraham or the Navabhashana idol of the Dandayudapani at the Parani Hills. That miraculous idol confers cure uh, and benediction to everyone who seek the grace of Dandayudapani. Now, Hidaikadar Siddhar was a disciple of Boganadar. Now, Hidaikadar Siddhar's presence even today can be felt in, at the Arunachala where he has taken his Samadhi. The Purana of the Idaikata Siddhar goes as thus, like the Siddha knew that uh, there was going to be an impending uh, uh, drought or a famine and so he had uh, trained his cattle to feed themselves on crown flower leaves which is called as Eruk in Tamil and uh, he had also constructed a wall with their dung and he had embedded uh, some grains in onto the wall. Now whenever the cattle consume this uh, crown flower leaves, they had developed an itching sensation and they would go and then uh, itch themselves against the wall and some grains would come out. Now Edekadar Siddhar used to mix the milk of uh, these goats along with those grains and uh, he would consume them. Thus, he was always uh, insulated uh, from the ravages of the famine. Now, the nine planets which actually control a person's destiny were quite stunned and amazed at uh, the resilience of Idaikadar Siddhar. So, they decided to pay him a visit. Idaikadar Siddhar knew through his wisdom that the, uh, these were indeed the nine planets and uh, he fed them uh, an intoxicating nectar and uh, they all fell asleep. Once they were asleep, Idaikadar Siddhar arranged the nine planets in such a way uh, that the malefic effects were absolutely gone and uh, uh, they were going to be very uh, beneficial uh, to the human uh, mankind. So, the Navagrahas woke up and Idaikadar Siddhar always prayed to them that uh, for the welfare of humanity. Now, this is the uh, folklore or legend that we uh, know about the Idaikadar Siddhar. Now, Idaikadar Siddhar has predicted uh, and given his guidance for each of the Tamil years. Now, the Tamil calendar, uh, each year would repeat itself once in 60 years. And each Tamil year commences on April 14th during the Chitra month. Now, the Sarvari year uh, came thrice during the period 1900 to 2021. Now, I would request all of you to click on the subscribe button to receive such astonishing and proofs of miracles, both in English and Tamil. The Sarvari years that correspond to the Gregorian calendars, now all of us uh, are following the Gregorian calendar. So, it happened uh, during 1900 till date on three occasions, during 2020 to 2021, during 1960 to 1961 and during 1900 to 1901. Now, what did the Siddha Idaikadar uh, predict or foretell for the Sarvari year? Idaikada Siddhar had composed his guidance on each of the Tamil year in the form of classic Venbas and uh, it's, a, it's a form of poetry. The gist of his guidance for Sarvari was people of all walks of life would be struggling with a disease that simply refuses to go away. He implies a strong outbreak of an epidemic or pandemic. In Tamil, the specific word that he had used is Tiramaru Noyar. So, that's the word that uh, Idaikada Siddhar had used for this pandemic. It's quite amazing uh, that the Siddhas who were one with uh, the Divine Himself uh, were blessed with so much of foresight and wisdom that they could actually predict what was going to come, including an impending doom. So it's quite stunning to note that he had used the phrase Tira Maru Noi, which means a disease that just simply refuses to go away.
Now, during 2021, of course, we had the most threatening SARS COVID 19, also known as the coronavirus. And now you can just look at it. It starts during April 2020 and then spikes uh, towards the end of uh, 2021 May. You know, I, this graph here is it's, it's quite uh, proof enough that we had the pandemic and all of us knew that we had this pandemic. Now, there is no attempt to back test or in, uh, do any such exercise here because we are dealing with the divine guidance. And so with all reverence, just to establish the wisdom of our Siddhas, I would like to draw your reference to 1960 to 61, 60 years back too, we had a cholera pandemic, which is quite stunning. And this is, of course, a reference from Wiki. Now, the emphasis here is on the year 1961 that there was indeed a cholera epidemic, that, that there was an outbreak and that threatened humanity during that time. And believe it or not, during 1919-02, you can see there were bubonic plagues. So, if you were to do this exercise, you would find that whenever the Sarvari year wa was to occur, we would always have some sort of a major outbreak of a disease which used to threaten humanity. So, this was indeed a great blessing uh, or foresight that Idaikata Siddhar had given to us. Now, how could this be a blessing? Actually, if we had followed what the Siddhas had said, we could have equipped ourselves in such a way that uh, we would be resistant or immune to any kind of outbreaks. They had actually advocated the use of Kaya Kalpa Mooligaigal. That is the herbs which will actually make your one's body become as strong as a diamond. Now, we would be reflecting by the grace of God Almighty more so on uh, these uh, wonderful guidances that we have received from the Siddhas. But here, we have clearly established that Idaikadar Siddhar had indeed predicted uh, that uh, there would be a massive outbreak of disease. Now, you can go to these uh, websites and their web links. You, know, uh, you can just check that these were the years where indeed uh, we did have such outbreaks. So, with our reverential bow at the feet of uh, the Almighty and Merciful and, uh, and Benevolent Arunachala, would want to close this uh, video with the fact that the Samadhi of Idaikadar Siddhar is in Arunachala. Now, actually, we do not know where it is. Some of them say that it is near the Nataraja, the Shivalinga near the Nataraja. Some of them say that the Aruna Yogi Mandabam, which is actually just behind the, the Sanctum Sanctorum of Arunachala, where there is the Aruna Yogi Mandabam. And some of them say that it is in the Goshala of the temple. And uh, some further say that it is up on the hill of Arunachala. Siddhas used to take three types of Samadhis, as we all know. So, we can't quite fathom the depth of uh, their greatness. But all that we know is that Arunachala is a place from where Siddhar Idaikadar blesses us even today. We will reflect more by the grace of God uh, on these benedictions bestowed upon us. Thank you.